Why are you sad? Why are you holding that paper? Oh, actually, I was sad to learn from our lesson about trees being cut because they are being used to make lots of paper. Yes, traditionally, paper is made out of wood, which is dependent on forest resources as a result of many trees being cut down to meet the supply of wood fiber. I think we can do something out of this banana leaf because I read something about it in a scientific journal. Really? What is it? Yeah, Lydon, what is it? Are you ready to make banana packaging paper? Wow! Banana packaging paper, that is fantastic! Yes, come on! Materials to be used are the following. Banana leaves. Corn starch, ruler, measuring cup, pot, strainer, molder and nigo, blender, scoop, basin and water, scissors. Instructions are modified based on a research paper production of wrapping paper from banana fibers from Journal of Environmental Chemical Engineering, sciencedirect.com. Wash the banana leaves. Then cut the leaves in square about 0.5 cm by 0.5 cm. Set to boil the leaves around 3 hours. This time we will be asking the supervision and assistance of an adult. Leave the boiled leaves to cool down around 30 minutes. Strain using a strainer in a way that the straining saves the boiled water. Put the leaves in the blender. Measure one cup of leaves and it must have two cups of water. Blend the leaves for 5 to 10 minutes until the fibers of the leaves already join the mixture while flowing. Then mix a cup of cornstarch with 7 cups of water and set to boil. Stir it occasionally. Then pour the mixture onto the mold. Then the left solid parts must be separated in a way it is not compressed, making it evenly layered and thin. Set it to dry with the heat of the sun for 7 to 8 hours. Limitation and recommendation. Blending should be longer, not just 5 to 10 minutes, but 2 hours. Aside from banana leaves, 
we can also use banana peels and other plants that are considered invasive. We can design a better molder using hardware cloth and window screening that is much better at separating water from the actual fiber. Banana fibers and other plant fibers can be converted into pulp for paper making. It offers productive use of waste fibers for creating a local supply of paper and generating income. Thank you so much. It is because of banana fibers and leaves, banana cultivation, and trade have been proven to be sustainable from social, economic, ecological perspective. Bananas are the most traded fruit worldwide. Interestingly, the banana plant is not a tree, but in fact, a high herb that grows 2 to 8 meters long with leaves of 3.5 meters in length. I am Athena. Try it too. I'm sure you have fun doing it too. That's right! I am Dirk. Let's make more banana packaging paper, sir, friends. I am Leda. I realized that we can use science and research to make eco-friendly products to save our environment. I encourage you all, Sai friends, to make banana packaging papers. Thank you for watching! See you!